Hello, friends, and good evening. Welcome back to Edwin's ASMR Corner. I'm your host as always, Edwin. Hello. I hope you enjoyed last week's video. This week, let's just have a little tea and talk. We'll talk about our years. We'll talk about things that maybe we would like to express some gratitude for. We'll just enjoy this kind of holiday season. And so, before we begin, please feel free to drop down, hit the like button, maybe comment, share, or subscribe. It really helps out the video. Thank you. And now, as you're ready, Please feel free to get comfy, to get cozy, and as you're ready, we'll begin. I hope you all have some tea with you. I have my Do Your Best mug. It's got some digestive tea, or digestive biscuit tea that my friend got for me from, uh, from London. And I have a little milk with it. And it's nice. Before we get to the talking part, I just want you to take a moment. Let the world still around you. And kind of take in your year. Let the good and the bad wash over you. as you take this moment, just letting things crop up as they do. It's up to you however you want to let this happen. Maybe you prefer something more systematic. Maybe going through month by month or week by week helps you catalog. It makes it easier to bring up memories. Or maybe for you, it's easier to just let the year wash over you as it does. And the things that are important to you will simply crop up. Whichever you prefer, just take a few breaths now. And just see what your year was like. As you sift through your memories, how do these things feel? What exactly crops up and do you have an emotion attached to these things? What are the memories? Did something happen to you this year? Did you maybe achieve something? Or maybe it's smaller. Maybe it's a little moment that's just stuck with you. Maybe it's a small simplicity of life that you're just thankful for. Whatever it is, it could be big, it could be small. Just taking a moment now and just reflecting. And maybe you had resolutions from this past year. Did you achieve them? Did you maybe not? Or maybe you got close. Or maybe you just made any progress at all. And that's good too. Wherever you're at, just 
just letting the year wash over you. While you're doing that, I'll fill you in a little bit on my year. And it's been a weird one. I live in Los Angeles. I work in film and TV and, of course, with the strikes. It's been a whole time without work this year. However, I've had a great time. I've been going to the gym regularly all year. I've been able to cook my own food and really manage my diet. And although I decry how many dishes I have to do for how frequently I have to cook to feed myself, I'm thankful that I've been able to do so as I've honestly felt healthier this year than I frankly have ever felt. <laughs> and that's been extremely empowering. And so that's something I'm quite thankful for. I'm thankful for the time that I've had to do these things I'm thankful for the motivation and the discipline to be able to keep up with a regimen like this. I'm thankful for the extra time that I've had to see friends and family now, as I've had a family member move down here as well. I'm also thankful for ability to travel this year, went to Mexico for my friend's wedding, that was extremely exciting, it was awesome getting to see them tie the knot, and then as I record this, I'm about to be traveling for a couple months, which is extremely exciting and frankly necessary for me. And so there's a lot. This year, in spite of the kind of purgatoric feelings of not knowing when work will come back and just kind of not being able to plan necessarily for the future, there's been a lot of good that's come out of it not least of which has also been this channel and being able to devote time and life force to it. And hopefully we'll be able to keep this going. All in all, it's been a good year. There's been a lot of good for me to be thankful for. And I hope the same holds true for you. I hope there's things in your life that have happened this year that you can look back on with a soft smile and just appreciate for what it was. I hope there are moments that fill you with love and joy Hope you've gotten to experience some wonderful things, be they large or small, a big achievement, or even just a simple sunset. I hope that this year held love for you.
that, we'll just keep it simple and we'll end it here. If there's anything you'd like to share about your year, please feel free to do so in the comments below. I'll be taking the next couple weeks off just for the holidays and to ease up uh, my traveling schedule. And I'll see you in the new year. So with that, if you've got more day left, then have a lovely day. But if you're cozied up and ready to go to bed, then sleep well and sweet dreams. Good night.